What's up YouTube, Silver Dragons here, and in this video, I'm going to talk about the best places to buy gold. So, let's do it. Thank you so much for watching my video. I do sincerely appreciate it. If you want to learn more about investing in precious metals, or if you just want to watch awesome videos about gold and silver, make sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel. Okay, so before we talk about the best places to buy gold, and there actually are three of them, I just wanted to briefly mention that I recently did a full stack gold video in which I showed I have over 12 and a half ounces of gold, but that is not enough. And I believe that gold is actually on sale right now. I think that it's a very good time to be buying gold. So I went out and bought a few more ounces of gold and I'll be doing an unboxing video when that gets in. But I was thinking about this purchase that I made and thinking about people who are just getting into buying gold and that they might not know the best places to buy it at. So that is why I'm making this video. Let's get into the three places where you could be buying gold at. We'll talk about the pros and the cons of each one. So the first is going to be buying gold locally. Now within buying locally, you might have a few different options to choose from. There might be a bullion dealer that is near you, perhaps a local coin shop, or maybe even a coin show that is in your area from time to time. These are all great options for purchasing gold. Now, one of the pros of buying locally is that it's a cash in cash out deal. So when you go to buy your gold bullion, you bring some cash. And then when you go to sell your gold bullion, you get cash for it. So there's no paper trail whatsoever. Literally, no one knows that you've bought gold and you own gold. This is very attractive to many different stackers and investors alike. So that's probably one of the biggest pros, as well as you can find good deals. Uh, one really good deal that I got from a coin show was this American Gold Eagle. It's a, a one half ounce proof. I got this for $800, which is well under spot now, but at the time it was right around spot and I was able to talk him down from the price he was asking. Also, if you become friends with the coin shop owner, they could give you good deals, better deals than they give to other customers. So you can get really cheap bullion that way and that is always a pro. Now, one of the cons is that you might not have any coin shops in your area, especially if you live in a very rural place. So if that's the case, you might have to drive 50 or 100 miles to the only coin shop and they know there's no competition around. So they might have higher prices than you would find elsewhere. So that's one thing you need to keep in mind. But obviously that doesn't apply to everyone. The second place to buy gold from is going to be an online bullion dealer. Now, when you're buying Buying from an online bullion dealer, you want to make sure they're a large bullion dealer that is trusted. And if you're not familiar with any, I will name off a few. You have Appmex, JM Bullion, Provident Metals. Those two happen to be owned by Amark. You also have SD Bullion, Silver Gold Bull, BGASC, Monument Metals, Hero Bullion, Modern Coin Mart, bold precious metals the list goes on but all those ones that i named i have actually purchased from every single one of those and they've all been successful i've gotten legitimate gold bullion and some are better than others but for the most part i haven't had any complaints now most of those are for if you live in the usa if you live elsewhere you'll definitely have to do some Google searches. But the good thing about buying from online bullion dealers is usually you have many to choose from so you can shop around. If they don't have the particular bullion you want in stock, then you can go look at another one. As well as the prices are definitely different from dealer to dealer. So you can shop around and find the best deal. And you can do all of this from the comfort of your own home. I guess one of the cons from buying online is yes, there is going to be a paper trail, but if you're not worried about that, then I guess it doesn't matter. The other con from buying online is that you have to wait for it to get shipped out to you. And this can be a little bit stressful when you're just 
sitting around hoping to get that bullion in your hand as soon as possible but for the most part these dealers all have free shipping once you go over a certain threshold so that's not usually a problem it is kind of frustrating though when it takes a week or two to get to you and you want it right now now before we get to the third and perhaps best place to buy gold i want to talk about another opportunity that is gold related and this is investing in a gold company which could have more upside potential than just physical gold although i do believe gold is currently undervalued and on sale this company is super cool and i'm so excited because this is my second time this month partnering with amir adnani now amir is the founder of four metals companies which are worth over 1.5 billion dollars collectively they are uranium energy which he was recently talking about on fox news uranium royalty gold mining and the one we're talking about today gold royalty the first thing to understand about gold royalty is that they are not a miner themselves but rather fund exploration and production projects for cash strapped mining companies and in return they receive royalties on whatever the project produces or rights to a stream which is an agreed upon amount of gold or silver royalty and streaming is an entirely different way of capturing the upside of mining activity and in many ways is a de-risking form of exposure they have a robust business model that allows them to potentially generate revenue when the price of gold is both rising and falling and in some cases royalty companies can outperform both the price of gold and gold miners billionaire eric sprott is a big shareholder of gold royalty and this is no surprise because the management is so exceptional the ceo of gold royalty is david garofalo who was the mastermind behind the 32 billion dollar newmont and gold corp merger which was the largest corporate merger in gold industry history and the founder of gold corp as well as several other most successful gold stocks in existence ian telfer is also part of the management of gold royalty if you want to have leverage over the price of gold then a company like gold royalty is exactly what you should be looking into and i highly recommend you do your own due diligence and see if they're right for you and your portfolio if you want to check out gold royalty for yourself then i will put some links down below in the description and of course it's not a guarantee that gold royalty will do what its sister uranium royalty did which was go up 436 percent since the march 2020 bottom but if gold goes where i think it's going to go in the future then anything is possible and speaking of gold going places let's talk about the third place that you can purchase gold which i think might be the best are you ready for this private party sales without doubt the best deals i've ever got on gold have been from buying at private party now this could be in person or online but i will say that private party sales are not for everyone especially newer stackers because you have to be familiar with testing the metals making sure they're real you got to be able to determine if the seller is authentic and so if you're just starting out then don't try and go buy off of reddit facebook groups instagram ebay that type of stuff just don't do it but if you are experienced then you can wander into those waters because that's really where all the good deals are if you think about it people sell back to the online bullion dealers either at spot or sometimes below spot so there's no reason that they couldn't sell them to you for the same price you just got to be able to find these people now i will say it's kind of hard to figure out who's a legitimate seller and who isn't but if you're able to vet these people then you can get great deals in fact the purchase i recently made was at spot and again i will do an unboxing of that when it comes in but beyond that i would just say be careful 
be smart and use your best judgment. Now I am curious where you buy your gold from. Feel free to leave a comment down below in the comment section. And I wanna say a huge thank you to Gold Royalty for partnering with me because without them, videos like this wouldn't be possible. So again, if you wanna check them out, the links will be down below in the description. And lastly, I wanna say a huge thank you to you all so much for watching my video and I will see you all in the next one. Silver Dragons, out.